4.30 in the morning and I'm off to, is something that's gonna be a little different than what you guys have seen in the past. I have ventured off. I have now, I'm now doing something totally different than process serving. Some of you that know me know I'm kind of an entrepreneur. I like that kind of stuff. And that is exactly what I've ventured into. Um, my wife and I started a coffee shop. Uh, it's uh, here in Utah. Um, we've got four employees hired. We've been taking the time so we can get this coffee shop up and going and get people trained. And that's exactly what we've been doing. So I'm gonna show you guys the coffee shop today. So right now at the coffee shop, we are running on generator power. So we haven't run any hard lines into the building as far as power goes, except at night we have a extension cord that powers our fridges, our keg graders, just those smaller appliances. But to run the espresso machine and the grinders and all that, we need much higher power. So I've got us connected into our uh, 7,000 watt generator right now. So in the morning, I mean, I'm getting diesel on my truck, but in the morning, we do end up having to fill up with gasoline for the generator and I can go through about two and a half gallons of gas a day in the generator. And coming into the shop, it's pretty basic. We have all of our sinks back here, our drip coffee makers. We have our espresso uh, grinder right there. And then back over here to our espresso machine. This is a brand new machine. We just picked this one up uh, a week ago or so. Over here to all of our syrups. And our fridge where we keep all of our milk. Obviously you gotta keep milk cold. Then our kegerator, this is where our cold brew all is. It's been quite the popular one. So as soon as I got here this morning, I got gas in the generator, got it started up, and then I got all of our ice out of the cooler and into the cooler and the freezer that I have inside the coffee shop. So we have a full day stocked worth of ice because we've been getting a lot more ice drinks now that it's getting warmer. Cooler drinks are getting more popular. And then of course gas in the generator because the gas can't or because the generator obviously can't run without gas so that usually will last at least two days uh, but i usually fill it up every day anyway. That pretty much marks a successful day today. We didn't get crazy busy, but we stayed busy enough to keep us busy. And uh, of course we always have our last minute people, but then we're cleaning up the shop and the not so fun part of washing dishes. So, but that's part of it. Um, and it's not so bad since our shop is such a small little shop, takes up such a small footprint. So we'll be sweeping, mopping, and then shutting down both hatches. And I'll be topping off the generator again filling the water up again, and out of here we'll go. And that's pretty much a day in the life of the Kaysville Coffee Company coffee shop. Okay guys, I'm out of here, so I gotta be back at 5 a.m. Have a great day.